Welcome to Skate Diaries. I'm Val from Girl Swirl. And I'm Yaya, also from Girl Swirl. And today we are going to teach you something that we are great at, how to fall. So as you know, falling is inevitable. So today we're going to give you some fun and easy techniques that you can practice at home to get better at falling and more comfortable skating. Let's go. <laughs> so I'm going to show you guys what I wear when I'm learning new tricks or when I'm skating stuff that's a little bit out of my comfort zone. So these are your wrist pads and these get attached just like that and they help for when you fall on the ground you can catch yourself with your hands. So these get buckled just like that. Then we have the elbow pads which are super amazing for protecting elbows. It's nice to have a friend help you put your pads on because sometimes... You want her protected. Yeah. You. So these are our knee pads, which are arguably the most important part of this whole fit. Actually, probably the helmet. Knee pads, which are these ones right here, are super important, especially for bowl skaters, because a lot of bowl skaters will, will drop in the bowl, and if they don't make the trick, they'll just go straight to their knees, and that protects them from getting huge bumps, cuts, all of that. So here is my full protection fit and I'm gonna go through a couple ways to fall. The first way that we always teach new, new skaters how to fall is dropping straight to their knees and leaning back. Let's try it out. So you can sort of run up, drop down, and you lean back so that your, your feet, see how my feet are pointed at the ground and my knees are back. And sometimes, if you don't lean back far enough, you can catch yourself with your hands. So one example of that. Ah! Another tip when falling, especially if you don't have pads on, is to kind of drop, like drop, tuck, and roll. Why don't you just go ahead and show um, how to, you know, tuck and roll and fall from when you're in motion? Perfect. Oh shit! Oh, oh no! She tucked and rolled. <laughs> and that is how you tuck and roll. You just put everything nice and tight. Did everything perfectly. We love to see it. When you're skating and you feel like you're gonna fall, getting prepared and knowing that you're gonna go straight to your knees is super important and helpful. So in the big bowl, I ran up the side, I ditched my board, and I went straight to my knees and I leaned back on the way down. So wearing pads is so important at the skate park, especially as you progress and learn to skate bigger things. It's really important that you wear your pads so that you can learn how to fall on something that's maybe a little bit out of your comfort zone. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this tutorial helped you learn a couple tricks on how to fall. Most importantly, never give up. Never give up. Get out there and keep skating and wear your helmet, wear your protection. Girls roll. Girls roll. Girls roll.